Today I'm going to show you what to do with an extra hole in your sink. Now in my situation, I replaced my faucet with an integrated spray hose, and because of this, I was left with a random hole in the top of my sink. Now you've got a couple options when it comes to fixing something like this. You could install a soap dispenser, like the one shown here, or you could do a faucet hole cover, like this one. Because this was a rental, I decided to go with the faucet hole cover because it's just one less thing that can break, or one less thing that needs to be fixed. Because of the difficulty recording, I just took a picture to show you what I'm going to be doing underneath the sink. In the top right, you can see that open hole where the old spray hose used to go. What you're going to do is unscrew the plastic cap that goes underneath your sink that attaches to the spray hose assembly. Now, in my situation, it was difficult to get started, so I actually bought this tool that attaches to a wrench that helps you get it started. And once you get it started, you can usually do it by hand. Once you have it unscrewed, you can insert your new sink hole cover. What you really want to do is make sure it's lined up so the white piece of felt isn't being seen from above. You kind of want to center it, and once you get it all lined up, this is kind of when you need three hands to do this job. So here I recruited some help to help hold it in place once I had it where I wanted it. By holding it in place, it helps it from turning while you're trying to screw on the new plastic cap. With the top being held in place, I was able to go under the sink and hand tighten the black plastic cap as far as it would go. Then I used the wrench assembly to tighten it the rest of the way. And that's really all there is to it. Now the sink hole cover doesn't really look the most visually appealing, but it sure does beat a hole in your sink. Thanks for watching.